American Abroad Collecting Currency Abroad. Joining you for my newest installment. I've been on a hiatus for a while, busy at work, busy investing in some other investments, and just busy with uh, familial matters for that matter. I um, want to show you guys what I picked up when I was in Florida. I got this at the Goodwill. It's the official red book, A Guide of United States Paper Money, second edition. It's not the newest edition on the market. It only goes up to 2004A, but uh, there's of course some newer editions that will have six, nine, and of course probably even 13 at this, mat at this point. But it has all the other older notes, and um, I was looking up the notes that I had found here. Just want to show you guys, this is the mystery money envelope. Let's see what's inside. And uh, we have a $5 and a $10 bill. Let's see what we got here. $5 bill is a 1950D, signed by Granahan and Dillon. And that is actually 102 million, so it's not a rare one at all, but you don't see too many 1950Ds. It was the one that was in the best condition, so I picked it up. I like older fives. You don't see them too often. And then here, a 1985 star note. That beautiful, small green star there. It's from the Boston series, so you come over here and you look up the 1985. And it's one more page. And it says 85 star note. 7 million, if it was in f extremely fine condition, 40, it would be about a $25 note. I'm assuming in this condition it's probably worth 15 to 20, maybe. Um, you don't see too many star notes from this series, it's a great find. Uh, I believe it's the first one I have from this uh, series, and actually from Small Face with the star on it. So I was pretty excited when I pulled that out. These ones are from the same customer. They had had them for a long time. And I thought I'd pick them up to show you guys. So thanks a lot for watching. I hope you're finding interesting stuff out there. Maybe check at like a Goodwill or something where you guys can... It's actually one of my favorite notes. We just went by right there with the bison on it or with the buffalo on it. Not sure which one it is, but it has a lot of great photos, a lot of great information. Even if you get a used one, at I have this note. Um, it's a great, great book. Shows how many were printed, shows how much they're roughly worth. Of course, the prices are probably a little bit inflated, so just thought I'd show you guys that. The author is Friedberg. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care. Bye-bye.